so this is a uh, Splotch the Mutts, uh, or you can just call me Splotch. I'm going to open up a new file. This is Fire Alpaca, the program, and it is similar to Paint Tool Sci. It's a free version. It's a version 1 full. Uh, there's no trial. It is full, and um, in uh, the best words, it's a really good program. And for it being free, that's really good. Okay, what am I doing? Just talking along and not knowing what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm gonna make this 1,500 by 1,500. I'm not exactly sure what DPI is, but I just leave that alone. And I click OK. And I have this big, uh, big canvas I can work on. I'm not exactly sure how to crop the image on this program. I normally just use Photoshop or GIMP and that. Okay, so I would sketch something, but I'm not very good at talking and then sketching. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, uh, let me just give you some basics. Uh, let me get my pen. Okay. So, we have a smiley face. A very derpy smiley face. Uh, there really isn't much to it. Uh, we can go over here and we can hit uh, click protect alpha. And that basically just you only can color on the lines and if you pick another color and you want to color this smiley uh, red it's only going to color in the lines for you and that's good for if you like sketching something and uh, say you sketched in black and if you wanted a a nice red so you can do that or if you are just you know uh, you can basically use this for anything. I mean, there's nothing difficult about it. It's just, uh, you're doing that, then you can unprotect the alpha. On uh, Photoshop, it's uh, it has a transparent thing, a box, and it says a lock, and then you can do that. But this says protect alpha and locking it is just locking the whole layer uh, you can't do anything see you can't you can't color you can't erase you can't draw you it's basically locking the layer for you so if you were to do something if you wanted to do something like in another layer and you were happen to go back then you know it wouldn't go back down to this layer because sometimes programs are glitchy like that and they just like to do that so it's it's nice to have that option I'm going to delete that because I'm not using it. Uh, you can use multiple colors if you're doing Protect Alpha. I mean, there's really no rules whatsoever. Uh, except for you can't color out the outside the lines. Um, I think that is that for that. And I, what I like about this program is if you get really close, there's these lines. that They're guidelines really and you can uh, change them up here that I have it off because I like it like that. so now that we've cleared that oh well let's color this back in to black because I really don't see anything I don't really see any need to uh, wait I'm good here. Sometimes I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Sometimes I use my mouth, uh, my mouse for coloring because it's just a little bit more convenient. This must be the wrong thing. Okay. Just gonna make sure. 